Although our championships are virtual this year, it's still really important that competitors follow the rules surrounding correct dress and tack. If there are any specific rules that you need to check, the IDA 2021 rulebook is available on the National Championship section of the My IDA website. This video has been created for you as a handy guide to pinpoint the common things that our tack checkers find at the championships when they're looking at our riders and drivers before their classes. All hats and body protectors should be of the correct standard. We will not be requiring groups to tag participants' hats for qualifiers or championships. You can find the guide to hat and body protector standards in the 2021 rulebook. If you have any inquiries about tack adaptions or special equipment, you can contact Sue Mack. You can find her details on the special equipment page of the MyRDA website. Dressage is our most common discipline for tack discrepancies. Quite often this is something as simple as forgetting to take off the horse's boots or martingale. We follow British dressage rules for approved bits, so please consult their rule book if there is something that you aren't sure of. You can find this on the British Dressage website. Jackets and jobbers must be worn for championship classes, and all VI riders need to wear a white armband. Entries with incorrect tack will be eliminated at the championships, so please be sure that you have a thorough check before filming and submitting your video entry. Carriage driving tack is slightly different to our other disciplines. The IDA coach must have coloured ribbons tied to their reins. They need to be a bright colour that doesn't blend in with the colour of the horse. These need to be fixed halfway between the terrets and the rear of the horse so that the judge can see that the IDA coach is not controlling the turnout. Drivers and teams are to wear group colours. All horses, carriages and harness must have been assessed according to IDA carriage driving guidelines. Unlike our dressage riders, show jumpers are permitted to have boots and martingales on their horses. If a riders need a neck strap, then this must be attached to a martingale or breastplate. Up to level 3 riders are permitted to wear their RDA group jumpers, but for the championships we do encourage the use of jackets. If there is any item of tack or dress that you aren't sure of, then please do ask your regional show jumping coach for guidance. If you aren't sure who this is, then please contact National Office and we will be happy to help. Countryside challenge rules require RDA jumpers or jackets to be worn by competitors. Similar to show jumping, a neck or balance strap can be fitted to the martingale or breastplate. If you have your countryside challenge course set up on grass, then daisy reins or grass reins can be used providing they are fitted correctly. All lead reins must be fitted to a coupling below the reins so that they don't come past the horse's chin. A head collar can be used under the bridle, providing the noseband of the bridle is removed. Vaulting dress is quite specific, with form-fitting clothing required and soft shoes. Riding hats must not have a peak. It is recommended that lungers wear a hat and gloves. Snaffle bridles should be used at all times, with a lunge line attached to the inner ring of the bit or onto a lunge caverson. Although endurance isn't a competitive event at the National Championships this year, we do encourage riders to wear correct and safe riding gear, and the same for their horse's tack. You won't need a number bib, but we do advise that participants and their horses wear high vis, along with any leaders or sidewalkers, so you can be easily spotted at all times. For showing, competitors are able to wear a double bridle, as long as its use and fit is assessed by a regional coach or a regional equine advisor. Remember, in an update to the rules for 2021, you'll need to have a lip strap fitted. You are also permitted to wear a side saddle if you wish. If you warm your horse up in boots, don't forget these must be removed before you film your show. We recognise that riders may not have all the correct gear required for showing, but turnout must be clean and smart. For any of the disciplines, if you aren't sure, then please do ask before you film your competition entry. We have an abundance of advice on hand with regional discipline reps, coaches and staff at National Office. Please don't forget to enjoy filming your entry. Share your experiences with us on social media by tagging us or adding the hashtag RDA virtual. Lots of luck.